first you will be friends with this person and then something romantic will develop out of this connection. So I see a romantic situation developing from friendship. And in this friendship, it will be, it will start with flirting, you know, fem feeling familiar and comfortable with each other. And then something romantic will happen out of this. This is written in the stars, so to speak. This is something that's meant to happen in your life. And it's something that you're meant to experience in your life. I feel like you might meet this person in a work setting or workplace. Um, this could be also college, university, school, high school, hopefully, because if you are underage, what the fuck are you doing here watching my content? Um, but yeah, they could have Aquarius, Scorpio also. Yeah, that's it. I see Scorpio and Aquarius energy here. But this is the type of connection that will start as friendship and then it will develop into something romantic. And let me tell you, it's, it's going to be like... One day out of nowhere, you will have this spark of emotional burn for each other and you will long for each other. Um, I do see that you will get used to each other, meaning that there could be some type of dependency that develops as well from this. Meaning you rely on each other too much or you will want to spend all of your time together. Uh, because you will be friends with this person before you become involved with them it's like you will be with your best friend and more you know what i mean like you enjoy each other's company but it's also romantic that will develop after the friendship so that's a good thing i mean i think it's a good thing in my book you know like if you cannot be friends with the person that you're sleeping with i mean i don't i don't really understand it but I see that this is the type of connection where it's friends first and then something romantic will come out of that. I do see that you will be attracted to each other from the get-go, but you will not see each other in, in under the in, intimate light until someone makes a move. And that move is flirting. You know, you will slowly develop the habit of flirting and touching each other like you know like touch touch eye contact uh, long eye contact and then it becomes more you see what i mean so it's not intentional but let me tell you once you become involved romantically with this person it's going to go to a uh, higher commitment higher commitment fast yeah some of you could even uh, want to keep this romantic situation a secret. Uh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, this could be a message specific to someone watching. Uh, you could be wanting to keep this uh, friendship slash romance a secret because you are already involved, or someone is at least, and they would want to keep this romantic situation a secret because it was it happened unexpectedly. And that's what I mean by this friendship turning into a romantic situation quickly. Or when it happens, it will quickly turn into a commitment. But someone here has already someone else so someone is taken here and the person that is not taken whether they know that the other person is in a relationship or not it's not looking good the thing the, the sad thing about about this is that you have strong chemistry meaning that your energy together is is wild you know like you are really good together but Someone is not single. Someone is taken. And I feel like it could be a specific message for someone specifically. But there is, for some reason, if it's not a relationship, okay, I see that you will want to take this connection uh, or you, want, you, will, you will want to keep this connection private for some reason. And I don't know why. But some of you will want to keep it private for whatever reason. Maybe it's like... Uh, you have family members that do not approve of this person 
or you have friends that do not approve of this person. Maybe someone's reputation is not so great, but the other person doesn't care. So it's almost like you will like each other and will want to be together despite the circumstance. Despite the circumstance, you will develop feelings for each other. I do see that there is age difference. Uh, there could be that could be why you want to keep this connection a secret because there is an age difference. Um, but so, but like whether this is a relationship that that's why you want to keep it a secret or age gap, or family that doesn't approve of the connection or the person, or friends that do not approve of this person because of their reputation. Whatever it is, I see that you will choose to keep it a private matter. You will still continue to be friends in front of other people, but the romantic side of things you will not share with others. You might tell a friend that is close to you about this connection, mm, but I don't think that the public will know. It's, it's, it will not be publicly announced. It will not be something that is publicly exclusive. Um, yeah, you know what? Uh, I don't see this ending well. I don't see this ending well. In fact, this will result in a third party situation or is already a situation that has a third party. And it will cause some heartbreak here. If this is a situation where you are going to get involved with someone that is already involved, let me tell you how it's going to go. It's going to be slow as fuck and you will be kept a secret. Meaning that the person that they are already with will be valued more than you. And that will do something inside of you. It will make you feel bad, okay? It will make you feel bad because you think that the other person is more important than you. Uh, whether that's true or not, that's how you will feel. Because they will not want to break up with the person that they are in a relationship with. Uh, so you will be kept a secret, a side piece, if you will, you know, uh, and that is not a good position to be in. Okay, that is not a good position to be in. And the thing is, I see you developing feelings for this person. But it, the more you have feelings for this person, the, co the more complicated and dramatic it becomes meaning that you get jealous when they are with the other person and you will kind of like hate every minute that you are apart and trust will suffer from this, meaning that you will trust each other less and less because this person is doing what you don't want them to do and they will think that you might be doing what you don't want them to do. The connection between the two of you will go to commitment but it's going to be in secrecy so you might be if you are the single one and they are the taken one you will be uh, feeling like you're wasting your time because they're not making a move to make this exclusive and official and yeah it's gonna hurt it's gonna hurt why is this person Okay, so show me this person's intention or action in regards to the end game or the what will happen in the long run. You will be together when they get rid of the third party. But when that happens, is that the, that is the question? When the, when will the when will that happen? <sighs> they will lie. They will lie to you and lie to the other person. There could be some serious age gap here and maybe even like an immature energy. Maybe someone here is so inexperienced and lacks the empathy because they lack the experience in relationships. This person is not really thinking about them. They're, they're not thinking about other people besides themselves.
Yeah, you know what? This does not look good, okay? It started really well, but it was masked. Meaning I almost fell for it because it's it's masked. Meaning that they could promise that you are the one and only, but they're not acting like it. Their behavior is not matching their words. And when someone promises you the world, just remember that words are free. Everyone can say whatever they want. But action uh, is a bit more difficult, right? They will not back their words with action. In fact, they will waste your time. So if you have a feeling that this person is wasting your time, it's because your intuition is, tr is trying to save you the time and the pain. The more you get involved with this person or the more you develop feelings for this person, the, the more complicated it gets and you will feel more stuck in it because you have feelings for the person. When we have feelings for someone, we try to excuse their behavior because we have feelings for them. So it's important to remember that the more you have feelings for this person, the less rational you will become. And let me tell you, that in itself will build resentment towards the person that you're involved with. And it's not going to end well. It's not going to end well. There will be lies. And that is what, um, like, that is the card that came out when I asked about how will this end up or how, what will come out of this. It does not look good because they might tell you that, oh yeah, I got rid of the third person. But they only said that in order to give you some peace of mind. And then after some time, you find out that they are not done with that person. So they will create more secrecy than being honest with you because honesty is hurting you. And so in their mind, oh, if I lie to you and lie ab about the person that I am breaking up with, so they have no intention to break up with the person that they are already with. Okay, so, and if this is not a relationship, like I said, if it's family, friends, or whatever, there are still lies. They will tell the friends, oh, they're not doing anything with you, and they will tell you, oh, they're not talking to those friends. Do you see what I mean? So it doesn't matter who is involved, but they will play the games of lying to you and the person that they don't want to break up with or disconnect from. This connection will be based on lies. And that cannot end well. Never ends well. And that's what I have for you. I hope this clarified things with you. Or for you. But yeah, uh, I mean, save yourself. Because some people will do whatever they want. And they are selfish, you know. Because they want you and want the other person. And, and they don't know what to do, right? But you have the power... To decide for yourself if this is something that you are accepting or something that is not acceptable for you because it's your feelings and your heart and your well-being that is on the line or that's are on the, on the line okay so do what's best for you because they are in, in their own selfish way but they are refusing to let go of the people that are in the way of this connection being established publicly or established fully and honestly and genuinely. They want to fuck around in secrecy, that's all. And if you want that, well, you will find out soon that you will be getting hurt from it. In any case, it is your life, your experience, your decisions, right? And I'm just delivering the message. Best of luck. I will see you soon. I hope you enjoyed your reading. Also check out some of the latest readings you might have missed out on on here. We also have the latest t-shirt design on sale this week. The link to that is in the description box.